There are two ways in which you can limit a search range of your text in accordance. One, you can use the search range command to limit your search range, or you can set the range in accordance to a specific search range. And so let me show you how to use both of these. The range command is useful if you just need to quickly uh, define a particular search range. In this case, I want to search for spirit in my ESV with Strong's, and I want to search for it throughout the Old Testament. So I'm just going to use the range command and then type in Genesis through Malachi and close the bracket and then run the search. And that's going to limit my search range here, as you can see from Genesis, and then scrolling all the way down to Malachi. Now, another way that you can restrict your search range is instead of using the range command, you can keep the word uh, here in the uh, search dialog, and then you can simply hit the plus button. And then under range or scope or bracketed words, you can just have the condition range is, and then you can choose your search range. So in this case, if I wanted to use the New Testament, uh, I've already got the New Testament predefined, so I can select New Testament and then run the search. And as you can see here, now my search is restricted to the New Testament. So here's Matthew, and if I scroll down, I'm getting uh, Revelation. And a couple of ways that you can define your search ranges in accordance is by scrolling down to the bottom of your search ranges menu and selecting Define Range. And then you simply click on New to add a new search range, and then you give that search range a name. That's the name that's going to appear in the search range menu, and then you can give your custom definition as well. You can even verify to make sure that the search range works. Now, if you're wondering, how did I get all of these search ranges in accordance? Well, the way I got these was I went to the Accordance Exchange. It's on the Help menu and Accordance Exchange. And I downloaded a custom search ranges file. It's under the Highlights uh, tab under the Accordance Exchange. And we've got a couple editions of them depending on your version of Accordance. This one will work for uh, any recent version of Accordance. And we even tell you how to install it on your system as well. And that will pre-populate and do all the work for you and put all these custom search ranges into accordance. Now, if you download that file, it will replace any ranges that you've already defined using the Define Search Ranges button uh, here at the bottom. So do keep that in mind. But if you want all the work done for you and you don't want to have to sit there and define different search ranges, you're welcome to download that file from the Accordance Exchange. Uh, place that in there where they're telling you where to place it, and you will have all the work done for you. Otherwise, you can uh, go down on your menu and click Define Range and define your ranges anytime you wish on your own. Or if you just need to temporarily or quickly uh, limit your search range, you can use that range command as well and specify the command that you want for your search range, and that will also work very well. So a couple different ways that you can limit your search ranges in accordance, and hopefully this is helpful for you.